Jim Hlavik, Draft Express, 2017 McDonald's game, here with Mitchell Robinson going to Western Kentucky. How's the week been for you? It's been great. Uh, what have you enjoyed the most of this week? Actually going to the McDonald's Playhouse to see all the kids out there that really look up to us. Did you uh, play with the kids basketball? Did you get some checkers in, read them books? What would you do there? Uh, we made cookies with them. We played a little bit of basketball and then told them about our life a little bit. Uh, how did you find out you were selected to the McDonald's team? Oh, I knew they had the thing on TV, and so I just watched it, and then I seen my name, and then I was just, like, shocked that I really made it. So you had no idea beforehand that you made the team? No, sir. How long have you thought about being on the McDonald's team? I thought about it the whole summer. That's one thing I was aiming for. Uh, what made you choose Western Kentucky? No, I just liked the school, my godparents over there, and then just a great environment for me. Uh, do you get any problem, any slack from Kentucky fans that you're at the wrong part of Kentucky? Yeah, they, they come at me all the time, but, you know, I just don't pay them no mind. You don't mind? So you're going to be the man there. Is there any pressure on that? No, sir. No, no pressure? Uh, describe your game. Like, what are your strengths as a player? I can shoot it well, so probably I can shoot the three real well. And then also I can dribble, so and I got a few post moves, so I'm really everywhere on the court. And what do you need to work on the most right now? My hooks, my left hook and right hook. Are you a defensive player? What's your specialty on the defensive end? Oh, I can, like, I know how to time my shots just right to block it, so that helps me out a lot. Uh, if you weren't a basketball player, what would you be doing? I don't know, probably just sitting at home, because I don't think I'd do. No, uh, what would you study in college and become later on then? Probably computer science. I like that. Hey, uh, Mitchell, thanks a lot and good luck.